I turned down a client this week. I hope I didn't screw up. I'm learning to thrive in the gig economy. Would you like to learn too? I had an interesting discussion with a potential client this week that I thought I'd share with you because I wanted to get your advice on how you might have handled this situation. Uh, this client called and said that uh, she's starting a business and she wanted to know how much I charge for editing blog posts, that she'd written a few of them. And I said, uh, you know, I talk to her about my rates and whatnot. And I said, okay, so where are you going to put these blog posts? What's your plan? And she said, oh, well, you know, I've been working on my website. I want to have these posts done so that I can put them on my website. And I said, okay, so when when's your website going up? Well, I'm still sort of figuring it out, and I've got a little bit done. I'm not so sure. I, I, I'm really, really kind of just, you know, working on it. And I just got the sense that she was just using these blog posts as an excuse not to move ahead. You know, some people do that. Some people just want to just find reasons not to go and do what they needed to do. And um, I told her, I said, you know, you don't need me yet. You don't need me because if I edit these things and they're just sitting in your inbox, it's not doing you any good and you've already, and you've paid me money. So you're out money and you're not doing anything with them. I said, go, go finish your website. If you want me to edit the website, I'll do that. But come up with a design, come up with what you want to do, get a website designer if you need to have somebody else put together the website. But do that first. <clears throat> Don't have me edit blog posts that are going to go nowhere. That doesn't make any sense. Um... I don't know if that was a mistake for me. Because who knows? I'm giving up free money now. Free money meaning that, you know, a definite uh, job right now. For the possibility that she may come back to me later. Maybe that was a mistake. I don't know. I mean, what would you have done in that situation? If you knew that the person was just kind of not really moving ahead. She was just sort of treading water. I just didn't feel right. I didn't feel right taking the money. I hope that wasn't a mistake. I wonder how you would have handled it. If you've ever been in these situations, I'd, I'd love for you to put the comments down below. And please, like and share this video because YouTube really wants to see that. And uh, subscribe so you don't miss any more of my videos. Uh, Till next week.